All right, guys, Mr. Antonucci here, and I have a big announcement for you. Starting in May of 2025, the AP math exams are going digital. So if you're taking AP Calculus AB or BC, AP Statistics or AP Pre-Calculus, your test will now be on a computer. But don't worry, I'm going to break down everything you need to know for how to prepare for this. So couple changes that are coming up is this new digital format is actually a hybrid setup. And here's how it works. The multiple choice questions will be answered on a computer, but the free response questions, those will be still handwritten on paper, just like before. Now, you won't have the multiple choice questions in a booklet, so you'll need to use the digital markup tools in Blue Book. Now, about the Blue Book app. This app is the app that all digital AP exams are going to be taken on. And this works for Mac, Windows, iPads, and Chromebooks. So if your school needs devices or Wi-Fi support, College Board is going to go ahead and provide that. The good news is that you only need the internet at the beginning and the end of the test. So if your Wi-Fi cuts out mid-exam, your progress is still going to be safe for that. Now, I want to talk a minute about how to prepare because this is a big shift, but we can get ahead of it. And here's what you can do right now. The first thing you can do is try practicing with some online digital tests. So you can get used to reading questions on a screen if you're not currently accustomed to doing that. You can also explore the Blue Book app before test day. There's going to be video tutorials and previews coming out. Also, platforms like AP Classroom and AP Central have a plethora of resources for digital practice work. Now, a couple common questions that come up is, one, about the calculator. Will there be a calculator provided in the Blue Book? Yes, but only for AP Calc and Pre-Calc. Desmos is actually going to be available for the calculator permitted portions on the AP Calc and Pre-Calc exams. This is a big, awesome shift. Now, I'll be making some videos about what that looks like, but just know that you're going to be able to use Desmos on those AP exams. However, currently, AP Stats will not have that embedded calculator because Desmos is not equipped with the full functionality it needs for all the statistical features. So make sure you bring your own. Now, Another question, is the exam structure going to be changing? The answer, nope. You're still going to have the same number of questions, same time limits, just a different format. Now, a big question that often comes up with digital examination is, what if the computer dies or crashes while I'm taking the exam? Well, no worries there either because your progress is saved as you go. And once you get reconnected to the internet, you can submit your work. So that's a nice feature there. And so as we close up here, just some final thoughts. Make sure you stay updated with these changes. You can look at AP Central. Make sure you subscribe and turn on that bell for notifications so that you can receive any future updates that I put out. And just remember, change can be intimidating, but with preparation, we're all going to be ready. So make sure to check out AP Central for more details. And let me know in the comments what you think about this shift to go digital. All right, guys. Good luck.